Let's just say I say, hey, hey, I appreciate it, but um, you know, I, I don't need gap insurance. I'm putting 15 grand down. Okay, guys, here we are. We're gonna talk about gap real quick because me and Dennis love to rock and roll and go through each one of these. So, so Dennis, let's talk about gap, okay? Yep. Let's just say I say, hey, hey, I appreciate it, but um, you know, I, I don't need gap insurance. I'm putting 15 grand down. Right, a lot of people say that, putting 15 grand down, yep. I'm not worried about it, right? So Go. I'm gonna let you hit in on a little compliance hit. If the percentage is less than, I think it's 70, 80%, you're not gonna be able to sell it anyway. So that compliance, you okay. gotta know that going on. Good, I love that. So yeah. basically, look, he's saying that if it's a certain percentage or under, because they're putting that much cash, you can't sell it anyway. So at this point in time, I'm buying a $100,000 car, yep. I'm putting 15 grand down, I am putting money down, but I'm not at that 70 X percent. Whatever right? it is. Yep. So guess what happens? I can still sell it. So I say, uh, I can still buy it from you. Yep. But let's say that I say, I don't need it because I'm putting the money down, right? Because I'm just an envisioning man. Yep. I'm buying yep. this equity, okay? Which really what I'm doing is buying my monthly payment lower. Well, really, when you're looking at a $100,000 car like you're buying today and you are putting a lot of money, almost 10% is getting eaten up by just your taxes and fees alone. So really what you're covering, Andy, is just your taxes and fees on the car when you put this amount of money down. Mm -hmm. And when you're looking Good at one. these big dollar amount cars, you know, that is a really exclusive niche market, you know, and when the economy gets tough, kind of like we're going in, a lot of people can't afford these and that's where you'll see the biggest hits in resale values on vehicles right now. So while you might not think you need it with 15 grand down, you always want to remember, you said you're with Progressive, right? Yeah. So your insurance company is obligated, what did we talk about earlier? They're obligated to pay off fair what? Fair market. Fair market value. And would you agree that what's fair for your insurance company and what's fair for you are two different things? Boom! So, Memorize that one. Yeah, by getting a gap policy, that's called guaranteed asset protection. And what that's gonna do for you, regardless of what the market does, the entire loan's gonna get paid off in full so you don't have to come out a bunch of money to pay off a loan and your deductible on your insurance policy. For $11 a month, it's a small price to pay to waive potentially 10, 15, 20, 30 grand. Yeah, and by the way, what, what is gap insurance? He just explained it, but it's the difference between what your payoff is and what the insurance company says your car's worth. Am I correct? Yep. And you know, you said what gap is, but I always think about like, hey, so there's two lines, right? Like there's a payoff line, mm -hmm. right? This is the payoff line that you yep. owe the money to. And then there's like your insurance, what they say, right? And the difference between that and that is really the gap, right? Yep. And no matter what that is, that pays that out. Correct. And in most cases, what's the cost of a gap policy? Eight eight ninety five. Yeah. When's the last time you saw a deficiency? Eight hundred ninety five dollars. Twelve ninety five. Depends. Ne Twelve ninety five. Never. 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 It's always eight thousand to fifteen thousand dollars. That's always the difference. Let me ask you a question. You know, I know you're buying this car today, Andy. Why do you think the manufacturer includes gap coverage on a lease? Why? To protect the leasing company because they know the potential hit from a car being worth less than what it's worth at time of loss on a lease is huge. Wouldn't you want to make sure you have it on something that you're going to own for a lot longer than the standard issue three-year lease? Yep, that's it. I love it, guys. So anyways, that's how to overcome gap. I just want to make sure that your mouthpiece is in, your words flow smooth like water in a seated position. Everything is written. Make sure that you know how to go through this. It's very simple. We don't need to overcomplicate it, right? Everything you just said nails it. Hey guys, I just want to tell you you're the true one percenters. You made it till the end of the video. Do me a favor, share it with the friend that wants to go to another level. Make sure you like the video, comment below so I know who you are. Set your notifications and then subscribe to the channel. We got daily sales training videos dropping. I'll see you soon.